Hello everyone and welcome to Sharp Dress Gaming and today we're back with the Pokemon X Wonderlock. I want to say Sharp Dress VGC because that's all I've really done for a long time, but Pokemon X Wonderlock. Now, uh, if you didn't catch us last time, we did just get two Pokemon and I'm sorry about the audio quality in the last episode. Uh, it turns out my mic unplugged right when I started recording, so it was using my uh, computer's mic. But hopefully that's fixed now. But we do have two team members as of right now because we have Wonder Traded our two Pokemon away. We have... Level 4 Pan Sage with Scratch, Play Nice, and Leer. And then we have Level 5 Shuppet, my little favorite guy so far, with Knock Off, Phantom Force, Gunk Shot, and Destiny Bond. Now, Shuppet is going to be able to run house on this place because uh, almost all the Pokemon have normal type moves, and Shuppet is a ghost type. So we have our battle here, and then we get to have our first, our first encounter of this episode, but it's technically our second encounter. But Austin has a Zigzagoon, which I'm going to also assume does not have anything but normal type moves. So I'm going to have Pan Sage come out so we can get some experience. Or we're going to go straight into Shop It. Straight into Shop It. And Zigzagoon goes for Tackle, which does not affect Shop It. So we can just go for the Gunk Shot here. And we're going to miss. He's going to growl, so that's going to be annoying. But, um... What's going to be nice about Shuffet is if there's any... I mean, it's not nice, but if it has to happen, it has to happen. Uh, <coughs> if at any point we're... <coughs> excuse me. Going to end up losing Shuffet, we can just uh, Destiny Bond and kill off our opponent as well. The Zigzagoon is being a bitch, because all it's doing is growling because it can't attack me. So it's just taking longer to kill it. Tail Whip now. You bitch. You fluffin' bitch. Get out of here. Zigzagoon does faint. Get out of my house. Get out of my house. I think this is going to be an everyday kind of series. Um, but we'll see. Pantage gets to level 5. Um, and now we can go in the forest and get our first encounter of the episode. Second encounter of the game. So, it is Santaloon. I couldn't remember the name of the forest. Santaloon. I thought it was Vanneville Forest, but it is Santaloon Forest. And we'll see what our encounter is. Of course, we got to talk to... Oh, wait up! Let's walk together! I feel like something exciting will happen if I stay by you. Can you heal my Pokemon? Damn it. I thought she healed him. There's a potion. I mean, not that we really needed to heal. It was just to get more gunk shots. And this is... For those of you who have it, are behind on the 8-ball on this one, uh, this is a replica of Viridian Forest from Red and Blue. We got another potion, hooray! Like, it's not all the same... It's not all the same Pokemon, obviously, or the same trainers, for that matter. But, it, the layout's the same. So we get, find a Scatty Bug. A little Scatty Bug! Which, level 2. I mean, most of the Pokemon we're gonna be getting over Wonder Trade are gonna be level 1 to begin with. But, um, who knows? And, we catch it. Yay, Scatterbug level 2. Scatterbug level 2. Gets traded for, we don't know yet. When under attack from bird Pokemon, it spews a poisonous black powder that causes paralysis on contact. Ick. Alright, so Scatterbug, what's your name? Scatter... Brain. Not as good as our other nicknames, but... It's a Scatterbug and it's probably going to get thrown away by whoever gets it anyway. Sorry, Scatterbug, but that's your life. So we are going to instantly wonder trade that little sons of gun out of here. So let's, in fact, wonder trade away Scattybug. It's quirky with compound eyes. Ew, I'll see. My hedgehog's being a little knucklehead right now. I'm trying to dig out a fabric. But, you know, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So we're going to search for a partner to trade with. Hopefully it's level 1 through 7. Let's battle Ravestorm from Louisiana, United States. What are you going to send us? And it looks like he's a little further along because he's got a little more, a little more uh, customized character. 
Shroomish. Ooh, shroomy. What is shroom shroom? Hopefully it's within good level. Hopefully it's a bread shroomish with like mock punch. <laughs> Actually, that would be good. I don't know why I was laughing. Mock punch is a breeding move, right? I believe it is. Let's see. Let's see. Shroomish is level one, so we did get a shroomish. So that means I'm gonna box the shit out of this pants age and tell you what. Let's see what our shroomish is. It is. Jolly with quick feet, which means they'll have technician when it evolves. Has absorb, tackle, and worry seed. So I think mock punch is this egg move, or maybe bullet seed. Uh, dex number we don't know. Okay, okay, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. So I'm going to be boxing pan stage, so he is not going to be on the layout anymore. But shroomish will be. All right, so let's get the fuck out of these woods. I mean, we still got a long way to go because this is just the beginning. Um, oh, damn it. Oh, damn it. <coughs> Excuse me. Got a Pan Seer. Yeah, pan Seer should only have Scratch as an attacking move, so we can just go to Shup It as per usual. Oh, Pan Sage, Shup It. We don't care about Pan Sage anymore. He can get out of my face. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. Oh, I just hit my mic. Get out of my face. Play nice. Does that lower my attack? Yep. All these attack lowering moves. Let's hit this gunk shot. Actually, we could have Phantom Force there. Whew! I should try and use Phantom Force as much as possible because there's a lot of normal types that I'll have to hit with, like, gunk shot and stuff. So let's Phantom Force them. Vanished instantly! I like how he uses Phantom Force. He, like, whew, dips down into the hole. Rap, and dips it right back down the hole. I love my Shuppet. It's so cute. And Shroomish is level 2. Level 3. All, our Pokemon party right now consists of Asian character Pokemon. I wasn't going to say Japanese because not necessarily Japanese. So let's see here. Sh oh, shit. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to see if it shows where they're from. Shroomish is from Japan. And so shop it. We have two Japanese Pokemon. And then Pan Sage. Can you heal my Pokemon now? I thought they healed... I thought she healed my Pokemon. Uh, right. Oh. She's good. I'll head on a second, young bae. She can find me a paralyzer. Look what I found, young bae. I'll give it to you. I love puzzles, so I watch everything more closely than you might think. I don't know if that's necessarily considered a puzzle. Can you heal me now, bitch? Okay. Well, we got this trainer. We got this little trainer. This little train train. Young train. Youngster Joey! Hey, Youngster Joey X, what you doing, boy? Scatterbug. Joey, I thought you'd have better Pokemon than Scatterbug, be honest. Little oh, Shroomish. Shroomish, you can be level 5 after this battle. Let's uh, switch Shroomish out and bring in Shuppet. Then he string shots me. I mean, it's the only thing he can do, because he's got, what, Tackle, String Shot, and Tackle doesn't affect me. So, Phantom Force! Bitch, I'm so faster than you. String Shot me again. Oh, I am three levels above him. Pop. Ooh, nice and kill. That Adamant Shuppet, though. Level 7, too. We gaining, we gaining. Nightshade, ooh. I mean, we have Phantom Force. And Nightshade goes off of levels. Uh, I don't really want it. Nope. Yep. Shroomish level 5. Yay! Now I have to decide if I want to... Um... Keep Shroomish... As a Shroomish until he learns Spore. Or if I should... Uh, just evolve him into Breloom as soon as possible. I don't think it's really necessary to get him Spore because we are just doing a playthrough. This isn't a full-blown um, competitive battle. So I think we'll just evolve to Breloom as soon as possible. I think we will just evolve into Breloom as soon as possible. Fletchling's going to growl, of course. And Fletchling's a normal type, so I can't 
Shadow Force that I have to gunk shot it. I only have one gunk shot. And it's gonna miss. He's gonna growl me again. Great. This is just gonna be the annoying part, because they're just gonna constantly spam growl because they can't do anything else at this point. Oh god. But we're adamant, so it does so much. It does so much. Even without an item. But we should take him out two more knockoffs, right? Yeah. Yeah, even if you continue to spam growl, we'll still do it. We'll still do it. We'll still do it. Bop. Get out of your fletch. Little fletch fletch. And level six, boy. Um, I'm just trying to think of the gym leader, because Ghost Resist Bug. And I know they have Struggle Bug. Probably Gust? I think I think Vivian gets Gust at that level. So. <coughs> so, I mean, Shuppet should still be good. Get a Kitty Pillar. A Kitty Pillar. It's level 2. I think Shroomish can start standing on its own. Pop. Yeah, it's only got a tackle, and it's a caterpillar. Caterpie, even. Alright, Shroomish! And it gets a level. So both of our Pokemon are level 7 that we're using. Uh, of course, we do have Pan Sage, but it's. We're not using Pan Sage. Oh, finally! You bitch! Alright, so I'm gonna be more. Oh, I would love more Pokeballs. Thank you. Thank you, Calum Callum. So, I believe that, um, yeah. We're, I'm just gonna rock out with Shroomy for a while and switch in between Shuff and Shroomish, try and keep them on the same level. That kind of nonsense. And then I think we can get another encounter on the other side of this place. You know? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We got a Pikachu. Um, absorb won't do too much. I'm gonna go for tackle. Thundershock does two damage, not even bad. Bop. Tackle does a nice amount. Hopefully we don't get static. Owie. Or just paralyze in general from Thundershock. Bop. And you just tackle again. Ah, honestly. Oh god. What did he go for? Wait up! How do we go first? I guess we're jolly, but still. Bop. Pikachu can get the fuck out. Yay, level 8 Shroomish. Level 9? Oh, we almost hit level 9 of Shroomy. So I'm gonna switch to Shuppet now. Oh, god. Hey, you. Heal me. Alright, so now we can just switch to shop it. And just constantly switch train like this so they're both on the same level. Our two monsters. I wouldn't mind a special attacker for our next, next Pokemon. Perfect switch too. We got a Fletchling. We got a Fletchling here. <coughs> Not that it has pack. I don't think it has pack at this level. Gunk shot one shots. Get out of here, Fletchling, bitch. And we're level 8. <clears throat> level 8, level 8, level 8. Level 8, level 8, level 8. So let's bring Shroomish back to the front. Oh. What? Oh. She wants to catch a Pikachu. She wants to catch a Pikachu. Nobody wants no dang gum Pikachus. Pikachus suck. Alright, let's see what this lady has. A Weedle and a Scatterbug, I think. Yeah, my Hedgehog is just freaking the fuck out. I'm gonna have to put him away after this episode. He is just freaking the fuck out. Pop! Get out of here, Weedle. Poison Sting, that's not good. We're just getting all of the freaking hacks. All the secondary effects. We got paralyzed, now we're poisoned. Get out of here, fucker. Weedle faints, and we get to level 9. Yay, us. Yay, us. Learn Stun Spore. Ooh. 
Too bad we're not a poison heal. Shroomish. Bunnelby! I'm gonna switch into Shepet. Switch into Shepet. <coughs> Excuse me. Hey, you! Calm down! Calm down! No! You! Calm down! Hey! You're fine! Calm down! He is freaking. I'm gonna have to get him put away right after this. Gunk shot. Pop. So you can go to sleep. Because he does not know what to do. You know he has toys in there. Or actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna get him his blanket. Hold on just a tick, guys, sorry. What is wrong with you? Hey, it's fine, it's fine. Here. Here, look what I got. Here's your blanket. Look at that. Sorry about that, guys. He's a he's a prom child, but I love him. I love him. He's so cute. Get another Pokeball. We just have Pokeballs for days. Hopefully, coming handy down the road. Oh, potion. Look at all these Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire users. So, <laughs> all the same person, Caleb. We only ran into one person using X and Y. A kitty Pillar. Is our Shroomish again? Oh yeah, he loves his blanket. He crawled right in. Oh, I should have should have healed Shroomish. I completely forgot because I was taking care of the Edge Pig. But right. come on, Caterpie, you mother lover. Bop. Caterpie. We don't even get to level ten. I mean, I knew we weren't going to. Hey, Shauna, come here. Shauna, heal me. And Shuppet got to level 9, right? No, he didn't. Shuppet, it's your turn to shine, then. Oh, God. Another encounter. A little pants here. A little pants here. So I can just Phantom Force this thing. Get it out of my face. Get it out of my face. Whoop. Get it out of my face. Get out my face. Perfect knockout. Perfect knockout, Shepard. We just bamboozling everybody in this forest right now. Let's get the fuck out of here, though. <coughs> so you got here fast. Seems like I'm neighbors with someone who has a lot of potential. The Pokemon movie is just incredible. I just want to solve this. Uh, I'm not this. Tierno. Uh, could, could you think of something, uh, maybe uh, something else besides how Pokemon move? Uh, maybe just one time? Well, we're all here. Let's go to Santa Luna City. Alright. That was so cool the first time you saw it. They were all like, yeah, let's go. It touched my little heart. Route 3. We get another encounter here. What are you all going to do? Why well, look for Pokemon of... I mean... I mean I mean, uh, look for, uh, Pokemon, uh, of course. The, the professor asked us to complete the Pokedex, after all, weren't you listening to that part? And furthermore, uh, different Pokemon prefer living in, uh, say, different places, even. To put it another way, it's a, it's a chance to find, uh, different Pokemon than, um, the ones in the forest. Oh, but different Pokemon will use different moves. I just want to see lots of moves. What are you gonna do, what are you gonna do, Calum Callum? I'm going to go to Santa Luz City's gym and take on the gym leader. So, you know, Pokemon trainers test their strength by battling with the gym leaders in each Pokemon gym. Well, you sure know a freaking lot. I learned a lot from others. Here, I have something for you guys. Adventure rules. I wrote down ten different tips every trainer should know. Here's one for you. Has anybody ever read the adventure rules? Because I sure haven't. I have no idea what's in them and I don't, plan on, don't intend on learning. Look at the rules if you're confused about something. If I'm confused about something, I'll tell you, shut up. I'm going to spend some time to get to know my little Froakie. What are you going to do, young bae? Nothing. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. Let's get an encounter. Get out of my face. Let's get an encounter. Get out of my face. So, for our second, third encounter of the game, second encounter of the episode, Burmy. Little fucking Burmy. Little fucking Burmy. 
Level 5, too. Ew. Ew. That opens us up to level 10 Pokemon. So we can catch that Burmy. Hopefully. Hopefully we can catch that Burmy. Oh, you little fucker. Protect. You bitch. Alright, shove it. What can we do that won't kill? Knock off shouldn't kill. And it's gonna protect, obviously. Avi! Avi, it's gonna protect. Knock off again. Bop! Oh, that did a lot of damage. Let's throw another Pokeball at it. Let's throw another Pokeball at it, shall we? Yay! We caught a Burmy! We caught a Burmy! And we get to level 9. Even better. Even better. I think what's her faces Pokemon is level 13 so I wouldn't mind getting at least level 13 before we take on that gym sack bag this is sack bag the Burmy <coughs> excuse me and it was level 5 so we can get up we can get up to level 10 as our trade Pokemon because for those of you who didn't know the rule that I set is it, ha it can only be five levels above it can be any level below but it can only be five levels above so let's trade our Burmy let's see what we get in trade for Burmy I wouldn't mind a fire type or a flying type to take on this next gym I mean, Shuppet will be doing will do fine in the next gym, but I wouldn't mind a little backup for a little Shuppy. Or Rock-type. Rock-type would be the best. I want a Rock-type. Uh, Hoopa SVP France. I don't have Hoopa. Hoopa! Actually, ooh, trade me a Hoopa. Trade me a fucking Hoopa! If, if it's a Legend, we're keeping it. Legendary Claws, I will invoke. A.A. Ron! A.A. Ron, we got a rock type! A.A. Ron, we got a rock type! Whoop! Hopefully it's level 10 or below. A.A. Ron. A.A. Ron, we got a rock type! A.A. Ron, we got a rock type! I love A.A. Ron. He's so cute. He's such a cute pie. Alright, let's check out A.A. Ron. It is level 1, so we did get an A.A. Ron. It has Tackle, Harden, Reversal, and Iron Head. Ooh, that's going to be nice, Iron Head. I, wouldn't, I would have liked if he had a Rock-type move, but it, beggars can't be choosers. So we did get a sturdy Aeron. It was hatched in Lumio City. Huh. What do you know? So we got an Aeron. 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 So I'm definitely going to level up Aeron. Um, so I'm going to put him in the front. Let's put Aaron in the front so we can level up this little mofo. And let's <coughs> continue over to, <coughs> excuse me, to the city. And I, we'll get our we'll get our last encounter of the day over there, and then we will end off today's episode. A Aaron, a a a Aaron. Aaron should be able to take on a Caterpie. Caterpie only has tackle and it does one damage. So we got Iron Head. Pop. Ooh, nice damage, Aaron. Nice damage. You can get all this experience, Aaron. String shot me all of me you like. You're already faster than me, stupid. Stupid ass. Hey, Iron Head. Alright, and then we can just tackle. Save our Iron Heads. Iron. 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 Iron Heads. God, I gave my I gave my hedgehog the blanket, and, or his... It's, it's a blanket for him, but it's technically an old dish cloth. And he is loving the shit out of it. He's been playing with it this whole time. But we get to level 2 with Aaron. And Azuril. Azuril's fairy type. Normal fairy type. Aaron, you got this boy. I just, Azur, Azuril no water type move. I don't want to lose my Aaron. Okay, it knows Splash, which is fine. That might be all it knows at this level. Bop. Ooh, nice damage. Nice damage. Splash, okay, good. Whew. I thought it might know Bubble, but apparently it didn't. So get out of here, Azuru. Azuru. And we get to level 3. Aaron catching up. Catching up with the team. I wonder when it learns Rock Throw. Because I'm pretty sure it learns Rock Throw. 
because I wouldn't mind it knowing Rock Throw by the time we got to the gym. By the time we got to the gym boy, gym boy, uh, gym boy, uh, gym boy. Let's see. Pichu, 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 and a a run, a a run, a a a a, a run. Um, electricity, resist. Oh, charm, you fucker. You little fucker. Reversal. That did absolute nothing. So let's switch to Shroomish. Let's switch to Shroomish. I think it only has charm and tackle. It might have sweet kiss. Thundershock, okay. Good thing we switched. I mean, our Aeron... <coughs> Our Aeron, 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 is uh, especially defensive, but still. Pop. Oh, nice damage, Shroomy. Aw, oh, stat. Shroomish! You've been paralyzed, poisoned, stat, and paralyzed again. Within one episode. One episode, Shroomish. Yeah, pick up your slack, boy. Tackle. Yep, we're still faster. The Shroomish is... Oh, it has quick feet. That's why... I forgot, Shroomish has quick feet. That's why when you get paralyzed, we're still faster. A, 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 run. Mud slap. Let's get rid of Harden. Let's get rid of Harden from Mud slap. So I think I'm going to leave the paralysis on Shroomish for now. So I don't really mind it. I don't really mind it. Not one bit. Not one bit. Oh, God. Coming through. Yeah. I'll come back and battle these trainers uh, in the grinding montage for the next episode because I don't want to take the whole time. The entire time doing that. I just want to go get that lasting. Oh, God, Tierno. Oh, hey, the wrong bay. Get your Pokemon here, too. The Pokemon are so great. The talks are later. Counter. Did you hear your Pokemon? Did you pass the Pokemon? Counter. Appreciate You know, Pokemon and trying to appreciate you and you come more and carry on. There you go. You know, did they do? Hey, young baby, there's a Pokemon in the back of the Pokemon Center. It's a good idea to stock up Pokeball bows and stuff with Pokemon. Shut up, Chiron. So we're going to heal up our Pokemon. We're going to deposit the Pan Sage because it's a piece of shit. And nobody wants a Pan Sage. And, <coughs> and then we're going to go and get our last encounter for the day. And we will end off the episode. We will end off said episode. So I'm going to drop off a little Pan Sagey. Pan Sagen. Sagen Park. Pan Sagen Park. Um, so we got our three Pokemon here. Oh, we didn't... Oh, yeah, we looked at Aeron. It's careful. We looked at Aeron. It's careful. So let's get one more encounter going here. One more encounter. Go in here. One more encounter. I need a beer. Not really. Maybe tomorrow. So let's get... Let's get... Uh, yeah, I got, uh, route 22. Can we get past this person? Nope. <coughs> Route 22. Uh, yes, of course. Rising Star Louise. Psyduck. Uh-oh. Psyduck might be a problem. Psyduck. Especially for AA run. Unless it only has Scratch. It might have Water Gun, though, so I don't want to risk it. Though we do have Sturdy. Oh, I've got a Shroomish. What am I worried about? I got a little Shroom Shroom. A little Shroom Shroom. A little Shroom Shroom Shroom. And Psyduck goes for Tail Whip. Tail Whip. I want to see how much Absorb does. Although we are Jolly Nature. Oh, it still does a nice amount. Shroomish, you didn't even move. Water Sport. So it's Water Sport, Tail Whip, Scratch. I'm thinking that's all it has. Absorb. Ooh. I thought Shroomish like, jumps up and shakes when it does Absorb, but apparently not. Apparently Absorb isn't worth its time. Creep. Alright, Shroomy. Good job. And Psyduck falls. Falls victim to Shroomish. And we get to level 10. And Aaron gets level 5. And Lit Leo. I'm sure it has Ember. I want to try some. We have Sturdy. We have Sturdy. So I'm going to bring an air on. And Lit Leo is going to come out. I'm sure it's going to use Ember. I'm going to use Reversal on it. Use Tackle, you bitch. 
That only does one damage. Bastard. Reversal! Bop! Oh, that does absolutely nothing. It must not have Ember, then, at this level. Watch these Ember. Damn it. Don't die, Aaron. God, that does nothing. What's that? Accuracy is lowered. Okay, it had water sports. So we're going to switch out now because that Ember's going to be doing a fuck ton more now that water sports gone. Shut it. <laughs> Try to use tackle. Get predicted, bitch. Um, I'm going to gunk shot. Gunk shot. Yeah, connects. Dead. Dead lit Leo. Dead lit Leo. Dead lit Leo. I wouldn't mind having a lit Leo. But nobody, nobody wanted to trade Leos. And Aaron gets level six. My cute little Aaron gets level six. And then we're gonna get our encounter. So our first encounter for Route 22 is Azuril. Azuril, Azuril, Azu, Azu, Azuril, Azuril. This thing could have bubble. It could have bubble at this point, so I'm gonna switch out. Because it's level 6, the other one was like level 3 or something? 4 or 5 maybe? Tail whip. Tail whip. I'm gonna try and just throw a Pokeball at it. Although it probably won't stay in there. And then I'll hit it with probably a knockoff or something. Because knockoff shouldn't kill, it's a fairy type. Damn you. Damn you, Azuril. Damn you. You have Water Sport, Tail Whip. Alright, let's knock off. <coughs> Bop. Yeah, that does nothing. We can hit him a couple more times. Tail Whip. Tail Whip. Knock off once again. Bop. And one more knock off. Should be fine then. And he's just going to continue to Tail Whip. He must not have an attacking move. It must be Water Sport, Splash, Tail Whip. And water, it does have water gun. You little monkey. You little monkey licker. Alright. Throw that Pokeball. And we should catch it. Keyword here is should catch it. And we do. So now we have an Azuril. I mean, we don't have an Azuril. We have an Azuril to trade. Azuril. Level six, and we get to level ten with Shuppet. He wants to learn Spite. No, thank you. No, thank you. And Aaron gets to level seven. <coughs> a Zuril. A Pokemon that lo lives by water. It moves quickly on land by bouncing on its big tail. Yes. Um, it's a female. So, Nexina, in honor of Num Nexus, Nexina. All right, and let's Wonder Trade that little mofo away. I'm gonna come out here to Wonder Trade it. And the next episode, we're gonna start off with a grinding montage because I want to get Aaron. I think I'm gonna get Aaron to level 13, um, so that he can go against the the Vion and stuff, but. Docile, thick fat, splash, water gun, tail whip, and water sport. So not a very good Azuril. Sorry to whoever gets this, but that's how Wonder Trade works, bitch. <laughs> I've got my fair share of shite, including that Pan Sage. The, who knows, the Pan Sage could come in handy if Shroomish ever faints, passes out, if you will. Faint pass outs. Pass out faints. We get South Korea, Gangwon Duel. South Korea. Let's see what we get from South Korea. It looks like it's a XY player, somebody who's gone through the game a little bit. A uh, Zigzagoon. <laughs> Damn it. So we get a Zigzagoon. I'm assuming this is going to be the right level. Zigzagoon. Zigzags. The Zigzags. I wonder if that's a nickname or if that's like a just a different language. And she was just getting rid of it because somebody tra wanted to trade it to her. But let's take a look at Zigzagoon. We're not going to keep it because it's a piece of garbage. Ooh, but Zigzagoon does have pickup. 
No, this one has gluttony. Shit, it does have a potion though. Uh, <coughs> it's a terrible zigzagoon in general. It's from Germany, so that must that must just be what Germ Germans call zigzagoon. Take zigzags. Yeah, must be. Well, we're getting rid of that thing. I mean, we got a potion, so not all is lost. But I'm gonna run back, get rid of that zigzagoon instantly, instantaneously, even. <laughs> Organize the boxes. Let's go get the zigzagoon away. It's a mild nature zigzagoon. So this is going to be our team. Aaron, level 7. Shroomish, level 10. And Shuppet, level 10. So, honestly, I really only want to get a Aaron leveled up. Because level 10 is fine for Shuppet and Shroomish. I want to get Aaron to level 13. Hopefully he learns Rock Throw by that point. If not, I might go until he learns Rock Throw. Just for that. But anyway, guys. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. Um, yeah. Thank you for joining me. And we'll see you next episode. Bye.